welcome my amazing viewers thank you so much for joining me on my program once again i appreciate you wherever you are connecting from if you have not subscribed to my channel please kindly subscribe to my channel click the notification bell so that you be notified each time i upload a video you will be among the first to receive it thank you so much and remember this whenever you look my video whenever you watch my video share the video to all platforms share it to family and friends share it in your whatsapp group so that people can get information on what is happening in the contraption called nigeria mainly against the beer france against the Duduas, against the indigenous people in the country called nigeria i try as much as possible to set the record straight i don't preach hate speech i don't speak against people i set the record straight the only important thing i do here is to make sure that the plight of the people remains on the front corner and the world will know the true story of what is going on in the country called nigeria remember they will always change the narrative. The government will always try as much as possible to use the conventional media to change the narrative. But that I will not allow. In this platform, we set the record straight and we say it the way it is. Not preaching hate speech, not by talking down to anybody, but setting the record straight and bringing the information to the front corner and letting the world know the exact situation of things. Each time you watch my video, you can equally go to the comment section. Put down your comments. Say it the way you feel it. It's so welcome. You can criticize if you so desire, but do it constructively so that we can be able to learn from one another. That is why I'm here. And now, I'm going to share with you a very important video. I hope after watching the video from the beginning to the end, you're going to enjoy the video. And you continue to stick around and be able to enjoy the rest of videos that are going to be coming your way from time to time. Thank you so much for coming. Today, the video I'm going to share with you is a very important video. On this special occasion, I give thanks to God Almighty. For a number of reasons. One, for the life and work of my brother, Chris Oyakilome. I have no doubt in my own mind that the purpose of God creating each and every one on earth is to make a difference wherever we may be. And if, and there is no even if, that is the purpose Chris Oyakilome has made a great difference in So for that, for that, I thank God for his life. And I thank God on this special, special occasion for this night. You will be hearing from my colleague and brother, President Ulop Jonathan. Late, later and you'll be hearing from my sister the ambassador who is a special guest of honor on this occasion but another thing I want to thank God for is what God has endowed Africa with. The young men and young women of our continent. As you have heard earlier, the African continent is bedeviled with a lot of challenges. That that is not limited to Africa alone or special to Africa alone. Other continents of the world have their own challenges. But why should life be different? 
from others. Ours is made different because we let others give our narrative. We do not we do not state our situation as it is. We allow others to state our situation for us. We must seize our own narrative and give our narrative as it is. First, God has given Africa all that Africa needs that no person on the continent of Africa should go to bed hungry. God has endowed us with all that we need so that nobody will be in want. Second, God has given us men and women of ability of industry who can give us and turn what God has given to us to a great advantage so that Africa will not be lagging behind among the continents of the world. So what my brother Chris Oyakiloma is doing with Future Africa Leadership Award is to identify, encourage, and develop leadership that will make Africa great. And let me tell you, no one will make Africa great except Africans. If you expect anybody from outside to make Africa great for you, you are deceiving yourself. And once again, I want to congratulate him him here for showing the way to many of us what we can do to make Africa great. I am particularly delighted. The man that helped Jesus carry that cross was a black man. And don't ever forget another thing. Jesus belongs to Africa as much as he does to Europe and Asia. He was born in that part of the world that touches Africa and Asia and Europe. And Jesus was not a white man like me. Nor was he as black as some of you. We don't know what the color of his skin, but it must have been a dark color like the people of his day because he was a man like them. Don't ever say it's a white man's religion or a black man's religion. It's a world religion. He belongs to the world. Thank you so much for your patience to watch from the beginning to the end. I hope you have learned something from the video you have just watched. The video you have just watched is to bring information to your doorstep and for educational purpose. It is not to demonize anybody. Let us watch continuously and see who can be able to make a sense out of every nonsense we are seeing. We must continue. We move. It doesn't matter what they do. It doesn't matter what they say. They will kill us. Kill them. At the end of the day, Biafra is here. Thank you for watching. If you have not subscribed to the channel, please kindly subscribe to the channel. Click the notification bell so that you notify each time I upload a video. You will be among the first to receive it. Thank you. 
and remember us. Bye bye. See you again. <music>